welcome back welcome back let's just uh, continue I'm in my bed and it's 2 p.m. I'd like to read about this but this is how you're making uh, the future uh, proce uh, processors like the Intel processor CPUs So that's the company there. ASML Holding, that's the only company on the planet Earth making these machines to make this advanced computer chips. I will read uh, next. Just read the uh, extreme ultraviolet. So let's read about this. And I've been watching uh, some video about it on YouTube. Extreme ultraviolet lithography. Extreme ultraviolet lithography, also known as EUV or EUVL, is an optical lithography technology used in steppers, machines that make integrated circuits, ICS, for computers and other electronic devices. It uses a range of extreme ultraviolet, EUV. Wavelengths roughly spanning a 2% FWHM bandwidth about 13.5 nm to produce a pattern by exposing reflective photomask to UV light which gets reflected onto a substrate covered by photoresist. It is widely applied in semiconductor device fabrication process. Daughters of 2022, ASML Holding is the only company who produces and sells EUV systems for chip production, targeting 5NM and 3NM. At the 2019 International Electron Devices Meeting, IEDM, TSMC reported use of EUV for 5NM in contact, via, metal line and cut layers, where the cuts can be applied to fins, gates or metal lines. Dot, one, two, at IEDM 2020, TSMC reported their 5NM minimum metal pitch toe produced 30% from that of 7NM, 3, which was 40NM. Dot, four, Samsung's 5NM is lithographically the same design rule as 7NM, with a minimum metal pitch of 36NM. Dot, five, Image formation mechanism in EUV lithography. EUV multilayer of silicon based glass spacer and molybdenum reflectors absorber EUV radiation resist substrate secondary electrons EUV multilayer and absorber constituting mask pattern for imaging a line. EUV radiation reflected from the mask pattern is absorbed in the resistance substrate, producing photoelectrons and secondary electrons. These electrons increase the extent of chemical reactions in the resist dot a secondary electron pattern that is random in nature is superimposed on the optical image. The unwanted secondary electron exposure results in loss of resolution observable line edge roughness and line width variation dot contents. History. Fab tool output. Masks. Tool resource requirements. Summary of key features Light source power, throughput, and uptime to uptime Comparison to other lithography light sources EUV specific optical issues reflective optics Wavelength bandwidth, chromatic aberration Flare Line tip effects Enhancement opportunities for EUV patterning assist features Source mask optimization. Phase shift masks. EUV photoresist exposure. The role of electrons impact of photoelectron and secondary electron travel on resolution. Charging and electron trapping. Contamination effects resist outgassing. Tin redeposition. Hydrogen blistering. Resist erosion. Membrane. Mask defects multilayer reflectivity random variations. Multilayer damage. Pellicles. Hydrogen bulging defects. Throughput scaling limits EUV stochastic issues. Pupil fill ratio. 
Use with multiple patterning. Single patterning extension, anamorphic hyena. Beyond the UV wavelength. References. Further reading. Related links. History. In the 1960s, visible light was used for IC production, with wavelengths as small as 435 no, mercury G line. Later UV light was used with wavelength of at first 365 no, mercury I line, then eczema wavelengths first of 248 no, krypton fluoride laser, and then 193 no, argon fluoride laser, which was called deep UV. The next step, going even smaller, was dubbed extreme UV or EUV. The EUV technology was considered impossible by many. EUV is absorbed by glass and even air, so instead of using lenses, as before, to focus the beams of light, mirrors in a vacuum would be needed and a reliable production of EUV was also problematic. The then leading producers of steppers, Japanese companies Canon and Nikon gave up trying. And some even predicted the end of Moore's law. But in 2018 Dutch company ASML finally succeeded after two decades of research. This led MIT Technology Review to name it the machine that saved Moore's law. 6. The first prototype in 2006 produced one wafer in 23 hours. As of 2022, a stepper produces 200 wafers per hour. The stepper uses Zeiss lenses, which that company calls the most precise mirrors in the world and are produced by locating imperfections and then knocking off individual molecules. This made the once small company ASML the world leader in the production of steppers and monopolist in this cutting edge technology and resulted in a record turnover of 18.6 billion euros in 2021, dwarfing their competitors Canon and Nikon. Because it is such a key technology for development in many fields, the USA even pressured ASML to not sell these machines to China. Fab tool output. Hash layers tool WPD hash tools WPM 5150 one five zero zero five zero nine zero 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 source asml to ship euv tools masks euv photo masks work by reflecting light seven which is achieved by using multiple alternating layers of molybdenum and silicon this isom contrast to conventional photomasks which work by blocking light using a single chromium layer on a quartz substrate an EUV mask consists of 40 alternating silicon and molybdenum layers winking sad smiley 8. This multilayer acts to reflect the extreme ultraviolet light through Bragg diffraction. The reflectance is a strong function of incident angle and wavelength, with longer wavelengths reflecting more near normal incidence and shorter wavelengths reflecting more away from normal incidence. The pattern is defined in a tantalum-based absorbing layer over the multilayer dot. 9. The multilayer may be protected by a thin ruthenium layer. Dot. 10. 11. Blank photomasks are mainly made by two companies, AGC Incorporated and Hoya Corporation. Dot. 12. 13. A blank photomask is covered with photoresist, which is then baked, solidified, in an oven, and later exposed to laser light using maskless lithography. 14. The exposed photoresist is developed, removed, and the unprotected areas are etched. The remaining photoresist is then removed. Masks are thin inspected and later repaired using an electron beam. 15. Etching must be done to a very specific depth thus making etching difficult when compared with conventional photomask manufacturing. 16. Tool. 
The tool consists of a laser-driven tin, SN, plasma light source, reflective optics comprising multi-layer mirrors, contained within a hydrogen gas ambient dot, 17. The hydrogen is used for keeping the EUV collector mirror in the source free of SN deposition dot, 18. EUVL is a significant departure from the deep ultraviolet lithography standard. All matter absorbs EUV radiation. Hence, EUV lithography requires a vacuum. All optical elements, including the photomask, must use defect-free molybdenum forward slash silicon, mo forward slash psi, multilayers, consisting of 40 mo forward slash psi bilayers, that act to reflect light by means of interlayer interference. Any one of these mirrors absorb around 30% of the incident light. EUVL tool, Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory. Current EUVL systems contain at least two condenser multilayer mirrors, six projection multilayer mirrors, and a multilayer object, mask. Since the mirrors absorb 96% of the EUV light, the ideal EUV source needs to be much brighter than its predecessors. EUV source development has focused on plasmas generated by laser discharge pulses. The mirror responsible for collecting the light is directly exposed to the plasma and is vulnerable to damage from high energy ions, 19, 20, and other debris, 21, such as tin droplets, which require the costly collector mirror to be replaced every year. 22. Resource requirements. Utility 200W output EUV 90W output RF Immersion double patterning electrical power Kilowatt 53249 cooling water flow L forward slash min 160075 gas line 63 The required utility resources are significantly larger for EUV compared to 193 Nm immersion even with two exposures using the latter. Hynix reported at the 2009 EUV symposium that the wall plug efficiency was tilde 0.02% for EUV, i.e., to get 200 watts at intermediate air focus for 100 wafers per hour, one would require 1 megawatt of input power, compared to 165 kilowatts for an RF immersion scanner and that even at the same throughput. The footprint of the EUV scanner was tilde 3x the footprint of an RF immersion scanner, resulting in productivity loss. 23. Additionally, to confine ion debris, a superconducting magnet may be required. 24. A typical EUV tool weighs 180 tons. 25. DUV versus EUV tool energy consumption, measured 2020. 26. EUV tools consume at least 10x more energy than immersion tools. Platform DUV Immersion NXT 2050 IEUV NXE 3400 C 30 MJ forward slash centimeter 2. Energy consumption 0.13 MW 1.31 MW throughput 296 WPH 136 WPH energy efficiency per wafer pass 0.45 kilowatt hour 9.64 wafers per year 2.584,2001,191,3 60. Summary of key features. The following table summarizes key differences between EUV systems in development and RF immersion systems which are widest in production today. EVAF immersion wavelength 2% FWHM bandwidth about 13.5 Nm 193 Nm photon energy 91 93 EV 6.4 EV light source CO2 laser plus SN plasma effects in laser wavelength bandwidth 5.9% 27 and LT 0.16% 28 secondary electrons produced by absorption is nuptix reflective multilayers tilde 40% absorbing per mirror transmissive lenses numerical aperture na 0.25 NXE 31000.33, 
NXE 33X0 and NXE 3400B Heiner 0.55 in development 1.21.35 resolution spec 1 equals resolution forward slash wavelength forward slash numerical aperture NXE 3127NM K1 equals 0.50 NXE 3300B, 22NM, K1 equals 0.54, 18NM, K1 equals 0.44, with off-axis illumination ZU 3350B, 16NM, K1 equals 0.39, NXE 3400B forward slash C, NXE 3600D, 13NM, K1 equals 0.32, 38nm, K1 equals 0.27, flare 4%, 29, and LT 1%, 30, illumination central angle 6 degrees off axis on 2 reticle on axis field size 0.25 and 0.33 na, 26mm 33mm high na, 26mm 16.5mm, 31, 26mm 33mm magnification 0.25 and 0.33 na, 4x isomorphic high na, 4x forward slash 8x anamorphic 4s ambient vacuum hydrogen air, exposed wafer area underwater, apparition control, including thermal, none yes, for example, flex wave, 32, illumination slit arc shaped, 33, Rectangular, 34, reticle pattern on reflective multilayer pattern on transmissive E substrate wafer pattern shift with reticle vertical position yes, due to reflection, tilde 1 colon 40, 35, no pellicle available, but has issues is wafers per day, depends on tool and dose. 15006000 hash tools in field and GT90, all 0.33 na tool models, and GT400. The different degrees of resolution among the 0.33 na tools are due to the different illumination options. Despite the potential of the optics to reach sub 20 nm resolution, Secondary electrons in resist practically limit the resolution to around 20 nm, more on this below, dot, 36, light source power, throughput, and uptime. EUV throughput as a function of dose. Thufa throughput of an EUV tool is actually a function of exposure dose, for a fixed source power dot neutral <coughs> atoms or condensed matter cannot emit EUV radiation. Ionization must precede EUV emission in matter. The thermal production of multi-charged positive ions is only possible in a hot dense plasma, which itself strongly absorbs EUV. 37. As of 2016, the established EUV light source is a laser pulsed tin plasma. 38. The ions absorb the EUV light they emit and are easily neutralized by electrons in the plasma to lower charge states which produce light mainly at other, unusable wavelengths, which results in a much reduced efficiency of light generation for lithography at higher plasma power density. The throughput is tied to the source power, divided by the dose. 39. A higher dose requires a slower stage motion, lower throughput. If pulse power cannot be increased, EUV collector reflectivity degrades tilde 0.1-0.3% per billion 50 khz pulses, tilde 10% in tilde 2 weeks, leading to loss of uptime and throughput, while even for the first few billion pulses, within one day, there is still 20%, plus forward slash 10%, fluctuation.40. This could be due to the accumulating SN residue mentioned above which is not completely cleaned. Of dot, 41, 42, on the other hand, conventional immersion lithography tools for double patterning provide consistent output for up to a year. Dot, 43. Recently, the NXE 3400B illuminator features a smaller pupil fill ratio, PFR. 
down to 20% without transmission loss. 44. PFR is maximized and greater than 0.2 around a metal pitch of 45 Nm. 45. Due to the use of EUV mirrors which also absorb EUV.